Hey y'all, it's Lonnie Ray, the absolute nobody, coming back at you with another review. There are absolutely no sponsorships, no paid promotions, no collaborations, and no affiliations on this channel. And pretty much nobody knows who I am. So if you manage to find me and you're already a part of the family, thank you so much. Your support means the world to me. If you're brand new here, welcome. I hope you manage to stick around. I'm here to explore all kinds of new products, try new things, and maybe spread a little positive energy along the way. So if that sounds like your jam, sit tight and keep watching. Today I am super excited because I am finally getting to open up my skincare masks from Revolution Beauty, otherwise known as Makeup Revolution. Now, I do have to say there was a small shipping issue with the way the label printed out, which was my house number, but not the street name printed out. So needless to say, this package did not make it to me on time at all, which is why I'm doing it so late. I had this planned actually for months ago. Um, but we're doing it now and that's all that matters. I do want to say in spite of the shipping error and the time that it took, kudos to uh, Revolution Beauty's customer service team because they are quick to respond, they are super helpful, and they were willing to go the distance and do whatever it took for me to either get my product or get my money back. Now, I actually ended up having to go through the USPS to intercept my package and get it on the right track. However, again, um, even though it was technically Makeup Revolution's mistake, I'm not holding it against them because uh, it was a print error. It could have, it was, it was something electronic. Um, and while, yeah, I could argue that somebody should have looked closer, I have my package. Everything seems okay. It's all intact. Um, see, you can see everything's fine. It's not beat up or anything at all. And uh, I'm happy to just get into these products and, and I'm happy with, like I said, the way their customer service responded. Okay, so on first glance, I can see that and shipping, see some of my stuff, some of my packages here have been tattered, probably from all of the tossing around, but nothing's broken, nothing's leaking, everything looks good, so, um, so yeah, I'm not unhappy. Makeup Revolution actually has a huge line of skincare and a plethora of masks to choose from. So if you need a place to find new skincare or just want to check out new skincare and new masks, check out Makeup Revolution. If you for some reason can't purchase online or don't like to purchase online, they do have uh, displays in Ulta Beauty and in Target stores. And I know that there are at least four of these masks um, stocked at Target right now. Okay, so first up we have the Revolution Jake Jamie Feed Your Face Watermelon Mask. And I don't know if you can see that in there, but it actually, it looks like there are actual watermelon seeds in there. These masks are supposed to be all natural, and I got them... Um, just because this one in particular I got just because I freaking love watermelon. Who doesn't? I don't know a lot of people who don't, but I love watermelon. Um, and uh, this has a lot of qualities to it that I thought would be good for my skin. Also, I thought it would just be really fun to try it. Um, but let's read a little bit about what it says about it on the site. Okay, feed your face with our first skincare collection in collaboration with beauty content creator Jake Jamie featuring three Instagrammable food theme face masks and a hydrating essence spray all right that's the whole collection it says it's made up of delicious superfoods and amazing skin loving ingredients I want it to bring something new and exciting to the market something that I personally felt was missing 
So apply one to two times a week, a lot of work for 10 to 15 minutes, massage into skin for 30 seconds, and then rinse well. And this particular one is a hydrating face mask. Okay, so there it is out of the box. And look, you can see it definitely has watermelon seed in it, I guess, for a little bit of exfoliation. It looks like a watermelon on top. Okay, let's open it up. Ooh. Oh. Okay, I like that. Honestly, I smell a little watermelon in it, but to me, it smells more, um, more clean or soapy even than like just pure watermelon. But there is like a hint of watermelon there. It smells just really clean. I like clean. It is like a really, really jelly consistency. And then I'm going to use my cake spatula, so just so you can see. It's sticky. It's kind of like, honestly, to me, it's more like, uh, you know, slime that you get out of the vending machines, like kids slime. It's more like that than a jelly to me. Oh, it feels thick. Like a little bit is probably going to go a long way. Okay, so that's number one. Next in line is another one from the Jake Jamie um, collection. It is the Revolution Skin Care Strawberry Donut Face Mask. There it is. Oh, sorry, my fingerprints are on here from the previous. Can you see that? I'm just going to go ahead and take it out. There's sprinkles on the top. looks like a strawberry ice strawberry donut on top and if I'm looking at this quite honestly it reminds me of um, like strawberry uh, Philadelphia cream cheese with the strawberry seeds in it do you know what I'm talking about like cream cheese spread Philadelphia cream cheese spread that's what that looks like to me I don't know what do you think oh okay this one's got a way different consistency oh See, again, I get a faint hint of, of strawberry, but I don't think that I get strawberry donut from it. This is a con different consistency altogether, and this particular mask is, it doesn't say hydrating. Let me see what it says on the site here. Okay, it says we legit do not, we legit don't know <laughs> what we would do without this mask. This glazed cheat night treat is formulated with strawberry extract and antioxidant vitamin E to help provide antioxidant protection from free radical damage that can cause skin irritation and premature aging. Not just hella cute. This mask contains a powerful moisturizing complex of glycerin, urea, sodium lactate, lactic acid, and allantonin that work together to draw and bind moisture in the skin, keeping it hydrated AF. That's not all. An emollient blend of shea butter and Fractionated coconut oil help keep skin feeling soft and supple and work to prevent pesky dry patches. I actually need that. I have dry patches now. Um, must have indulgence. This mask will leave your skin glowing and you looking like a snack. 
Okay, so much different texture on this one. You can see. It's more like a maybe a whipped mask. It's definitely creamy, not jelly. And let's see. Yep. It's very smooth. It's almost like a lotion. It smells good, but I don't I don't register like strawberry donut. Like they're like fruity, I don't know, but not strawberry donut. <laughs> Next in line, these aren't as fun as the first two, and I probably should have saved those for last, but I got a pink clay detoxifying mask. Oh, you know, and I should say, normally, uh, these masks are $11 a piece, but skincare is on sale right now on their site. And I really do, I kind of like their packaging. It's glass, um, and it's just, it's really heavy, and it's simple, and it's clean. And I like that you can see what's inside. Okay, so here's what it says about the pink clay detoxifying mask. Congested pores. Unmask your best skin with our pink clay detoxifying face mask. One of four new targeted masks for your complexion concerns. This detoxing mask is formulated with seaweed extract and witch hazel to help moisturize and soothe problematic areas, draws out impurities, and absorbs oil to encourage a healthier looking complexion. In the mood for multi-masking? Stock up on our full range of face masks. So that's what it says about the pink clay mask. I would assume that it probably doesn't have a smell, but let's see. Oh, it's very thick. I can tell you that. Oh, okay. There is a, a fragrance here. Again, this is more... It's good, though. It's a clean, like, soapy fragrance. It's creamy, but it's a little bit more stiff than the uh, strawberry donut face mask. So yeah, very much clay consistency. There's a look at it. Okay, so next, and that's now. I now that I'm seeing actually what I got, I got the detoxifying, and then I got the purifying charcoal mask. Clogged pores? Unmask your best skin with our charcoal purifying mask, one of our new targeted masks for your complexion concerns. This purifying mud mask contains activated charcoal powder to help draw out oil and dirt from your pores to purify skin and help clear complexion. Treat your skin with this glycolic acid and lactic acid infused formula for rejuvenating results. There you go. There's it. Looks like a charcoal mask. Okay. Ooh. That's a little bit more liquid than I figured. That one's more wet than the other one a little bit. It's a little bit of run there. And see inside. This too, again, has a, like, they're going for a clean, like, soapy, clean fragrance. There's something a little bit different. It's very similar to the pink clay mask, but there's just something a little bit different in this one. And this one maybe smells a little bit more alcoholy than the other one. Yeah, I'm smelling some alcohol in there. That's what I'm picking up. Okay. And just so you see. It's it's not as stiff as the as the clay mask at all. It's almost it's almost like paint, like acrylic paint. 
it's that wet. None of these are peel off masks. All the directions say to leave them on, let them dry, and then rinse them off with warm water. Is the hyaluronic acid mask. Clearly, I got detox, uh, purifying, and hydrating, and then the other two were clearly just for fun <laughs> because I couldn't pass up, and there was a sale, guys. I am a sucker for a sale. It says overnight hydrating face mask. Okay, so this is a nighttime thing. Dehydrated skin? Unmask your best skin with our Hyaluronic Acid Face Mask, one of four new targeted masks for your complexion concerns. Hydrate your skin overnight with this Hyaluronic Acid Infused Treatment. Formulate it with sweet almond oil to encourage smooth and soft skin and vitamin E to moisturize. Apply to cleansed skin to soak in overnight, avoiding the eye area. Cleanse any residue or massage in upon waking. Use one to two times a week. So this is an overnight mask treatment. You don't necessarily rinse this one off. It is white. I'm going to venture to guess this one's going to feel more like a moisturizing face cream than an, an actual mask. Yeah. Tell all, already. Looking at it, it reminds me like a, of a Noxzema or something like that. Okay, this has no smell. I'm getting no smell whatsoever from this. And just so you can see, it's just like I suspect it. See, it's very, yeah, it's very creamy, like a, like a moisturizing face cream. And finally, uh, my final product is the Revolution Skin Care Stabilize Active Collagen uh, Skin Firming Solution. Clearly, this is for my aging skin because I am in that maturing skin category now. I'm going to be 41 in two days. Yay! Happy birthday to me! It's the other reason why I'm excited to finally be opening this stuff. I've, I've been waiting. <laughs> Revolution Skin Care Skin Firming Solution helps to gently plump up the skin showing signs of dehydration. This lightweight solution is formulated with collagen, an essential protein that gives skin its elasticity and usefulness. As we age, collagen declines, creating fine lines, loose skin, and dryness. Used daily, our solution helps to hydrate and firm the skin, leave it looking healthier and smoother. Shake well before you, supply a few drops to clean dry skin in the morning and evening for best results. For an extra boost, use Before Revolution Skin Care Hydrating Boost, which I guess is another serum that they have. So, and this is it. It's just um, a little serum in a glass bottle. It's pretty with a little glass eyedropper. And it's like a skin oil. Does it have a smell? So what I will probably end up doing with this is just adding it to my daily skincare routine and dabbing it on, you know, with my moisturizer. There is no smell and it doesn't have an oily residue. It's, it's, it's water-based apparently. I, I don't get a smell of alcohol or anything. There's just nothing. So yeah, overall, I am happy with uh, my skincare products. If you saw my last video and you are aware that I'm doing a giveaway right now, this is going to be opportunity number two for you to get in on that giveaway. And I'm going to cut into this video about now with those rules. So I'm going with my shameless promotional Elf and Chipotle giveaway. The rules are as follows. You must like this video, comment on this video, subscribe to my channel, and follow me on my Instagram, 
absolute dot underscore dot nobody. And finally, and this is very important, email me at LonnieRay2 at yahoo.com. The subject line should say Elf and Chipotle palette giveaway. Inside, you should leave me your YouTube screen name as well as your Instagram handle, followed by the word done. This is called the Shameless Self Promotion Giveaway. So, I'm not going to pick a winner until I have 100 subscribers on my YouTube channel. And just a final note, um, in case you don't have Instagram, that's okay. You can skip that step in the giveaway. You don't have to have Instagram, but if you do have Instagram, please, 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 please don't leave out that step. So once again, we've made it to the end of another video, and if you're still here, you deserve an award. Always keep in mind that my opinions are based on my experiences and personal preferences alone. I'm never trying to influence you in one direction or another. I'm just trying to give you my first impression and tell you why I would or wouldn't personally buy a product that I'm reviewing. I am just a nobody. You can make up your own mind. If I entertained you, remember to like the video, comment on the video, and subscribe to my channel, especially if you want to get in on that palette giveaway, and hit the notification bell so you know when my next video drops. Until then, bye!